I think we're good at working through a long period of time. You know, I think that they are they sustain themselves well. They're in good shape, and I think they're learning. And uh, what my message today was really just about trying to really take it further. You know, make it perfect. What what can we do in the next six practices to really step it up? You know, we we uh, we have to take advantage of each opportunity out here and. Uh, what can we do to take that next step to really be better? You mentioned before uh, how well McCants looked speed-wise. It just looks like he's running with more authority, more confidence, just based off the spring yeah. and what he did today. You know, I think I'm really, really happy for him because I think he looked confident again. You know, he, he ran with some abandon and uh, and he got tougher as the day went on, and uh, I thought that was a good sign. You got the Jack Lomax got to throw the ball around a little bit today too. I mean, I know he's a young guy and probably doesn't look to be. In, in competition to start, but how, how is he impressing you so far in spring ball? Playing the game. You know, Jack's got to get stronger, and, and uh, he knows that. But as far as, as as playing the game, understanding the game, making the throws, putting the ball where it should be, throwing the ball on time, all those elements, you know, that's why he can go in there and make some plays and move the team, and he's done that continually. Well, I think it's good for us that John redshirted in his back, and it gives us pretty good depth along that uh, that tight end H back area. Uh, I think that's that is really going to play out as the season unfolds.